I definitely see the stripes. Do you wheels? Coming up a little bit. Oh, we've got deploy discrete. Two deploy discrete. Yay! All right. Beautiful. Great news. Beautiful. What an accomplishment. Nice teamwork. Phenomenal. Okay. Excellent work, guys. Excellent. But it's not over yet. We still got to get you inside. That would be nice. Good day and welcome back to the Johnson Space Center for today's mission status briefing. On the, the, the spacewalk to repair the, the 4B solar array was a, just a complete success. Uh, we installed the cufflinks, we uh, uh, completed the de deploy of the 4B solar array and we put it into what we call high tension mode, which makes it, uh, which it puts it in a completely nominal configuration. And here you can see Scott arriving at the solar array worksite, um, giving us all the the lowdown on what the snag looked like. And then he goes and installs the first cuff link. And it has two ends. And they installed well. So those engineering folks that um, helped us figure that out did a great job with those. Okay, now here's Scott. What he's gonna do is he's gonna cut that hinge wire that was um, holding up the blanket. And um, after he does that, he's gonna crimp, crimp the end to a 90 degree angle to keep the hinge wire from sliding, um, from sliding into the array and becoming lost and um, creating more of a zipper effect. As uh, Scott approached, he described what he saw in terms of the damage as a hairball. And so we knew that it couldn't be good. So um, the guide wire had several frays and uh, as he described it, so we were already preparing, thinking that we were gonna have to cut that long guide wire that runs from uh, the top to the bottom of the array. Um, but before we did that, we installed that middle cuff link to give it some um, structural support. And Scott, we're getting a bunch of wiles down here, so uh, this is great. That definitely explains a lot. And uh, we released the hung up part of the panel by cutting the hinge wire. Um, this was, you know, the blanket was held up by um, one of the hinge wires and had a, a very large piece protruding. And Scott cut that and released that part of the blanket. Um, and then he um, prepared himself and, and wheels to cut the guide wire. And here you can see some more um, cufflink operations. The reach was pretty tough with the arm, so um, in some cases we had to pull the panel down to our location rather than moving the arm up to the location where we would install it. And so here you can see all five cufflinks installed and Scott standing back. <laughs> 